Hello, I'm Debbie Morse. I'm the National Hepatitis C Coordinator for Humankind. And in today's HEP clip, I'm going to show you how to do a dry blood spot test. So the first thing you're going to need is a kit that contains all the essential items. So everything comes in an envelope. So you have a request form, you have um, a sample card, you have two alcohol wipes, a silica gel sachet, two lancets and two plasters. Oh. And of course you need to be using the appropriate PPE. So the first thing that you need to do is to ask your client to wash their hands in warm soapy water or if there isn't any warm soapy water available then use an alcohol wipe after checking that they're not allergic to alcohol and they're not on blood thinning medication. So take the chosen finger and wipe it on the inside with an alcohol wipe. Please try and avoid the nail bed and the pad. The next thing that you're going to do is to press the lancet against the skin and push it in until you hear an audible click. So the blood will now start to flow. So you're going to have your report card ready. And as soon as the blood starts to flow, you're going to drip it into these five circles. The idea being that you completely fill the five circles because if you don't, the sample will fail. But literally, just drop it over the circle. Rubbing the finger like this will improve the blood flow. If you're not having much success, you can always use another lancet and take a sample from another finger. This does sometimes happen when the hands are cold. So when your card is completely full, you'll put it to one side to dry and you will then ask your client to go and wash their hands again in warm soapy water and apply a plaster. You need to let this card dry for 30 minutes and when it is dry you'll fold the cover inside, you'll turn over your request form, you'll slip it into the polythene pocket at the back with the silica gel sachet because without that the sample may fail. Tear off the strip when you're happy with the contents and happy that the notes that you've got on this side apply to your client. Put them in an envelope, tear off the strip and you're all ready for the post box. Thank you very much for watching today's hat clip.